That's just coming in. A university in Donsek is up in flames. Russia is now claiming that this was an attack by Ukraine. They are blaming Ukraine for cluster shells. Attack in Russian claimed in Russian controlled city. Claims have engulfed a university building. Those visuals that you see on your screens. This has taken place in Donetsk in Ukraine. This is an area which at the moment is being controlled by Russia. A foreign affairs editor Geeta Mohan is now joining me on the story. Geeta, extremely disturbing visuals now coming to the fore. Russia is blaming Ukraine for what's taken place in this university. Well, uh, the escalation when it comes to Russia-Ukraine war is uh, is on uh, an increase. We're looking at uh, uh, attacks not only on land but also in the sea. Uh, this is, in all probability, uh, Ashwarya, a retaliation to the attacks that uh, uh, that were attempted uh, on a ship, on a Russian ship, by the Ukrainian forces. And now we're looking at uh, 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 the Ukrainian forces now using cluster bombs and cluster munitions in the city of Donetsk, uh, uh, which is uh, part of the uh, of, of, of not just capture, uh, captured territories, but uh, self-declared independent territories uh, outside of Ukraine to the, and under the control of independent reb, uh, independence of rebels. Uh, the fact that uh, Russia and Ukraine war has moved uh, to, to, to uh, a second year now in itself goes to show that there are uh, that, that this uh, war is not going to end anytime soon, and with the fresh ammunition being provided by the uh, European and Western countries to Ukraine, we are looking at not just a fresh, a fresh uh, escalation, but also a, 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 a more serious onslaught by Ukrainian forces on Russia and Russia-controlled areas, also those uh, areas supported by Russia and uh, uh, Donetsk and Luhansk are part of those areas. So the the latest report is of a university being targeted, and there were other civilians over there, uh, a private residence also targeted. Uh, but uh, in terms of loss of life, uh, or for that matter, casualties, numbers are not clear yet. Thank you, Geeta Mohan, our foreign affairs editor, talking about the latest that is coming between in the Russia-Ukraine war, a university now up in flames because of the war that is taking place between Russia and Ukraine.